Hi, my name is John. I'm the owner of Light My Fire in Fairlawn, New Jersey. And in today's video, we're going to show you how to light the pilot on a Peterson safety pilot valve gas log set. So the first thing you have to make sure of is downstairs in the basement, there may be a shutoff valve that looks like this. Make sure the gas valve is onto the fireplace, would mean parallel with the pipe and not perpendicular. There also could be a shutoff valve that looks like this, either in the floor or in the wall adjacent to the fireplace that uses a key. Make sure the key is turned and the gas is on and make sure that there could be a gas valve in the firebox itself. So first make sure all the gas valves are turned on. The second is the valve is on the front right side and if you look on the knob, whatever word on the knob that's facing straight up is the position that the valve is in. If your knob is positioned on the left side or if it's in a different position, the easiest way to determine if the valve is in the pilot position is to turn the knob all the way to the left until it stops. Then without pushing in, turn back to the right until you feel it stop. That's the pilot position. Now with one hand, you're going to push the knob all the way in and hold. As you hold in, you have to take a match and you go back to the end of the pilot assembly that overhangs the burner pan with the match. When the pilot comes on, remove your torch, but don't release the button. Keep holding it in for 30 seconds after the pilot comes on. After the pilot has been burning for 30 seconds, you release the knob. The pilot should remain lit. And then to turn the unit on, you just turn to the left. And the unit will come on. You turn back to the right without pushing to turn it on and off and make sure your damper is open before you turn the unit on. Thanks for watching.